Everything is everybody else's fault, right? See, he even looks suspicious. Not really, but we do this all the time. How do we own our own stuff? Heath MD here, psychoanalyst for Freud Alicious Mind. Get to know the depths of your unconscious and find yourself. Paranoia seems like a waste of energy, right? We get all weird about the other person, but we're make-believing they're bad in the first place. If we're that dedicated to seeing something a certain way, there must be a really good reason why we're doing it. Our unconscious wants us to be as chill as possible. So what happens when change comes our way? Or when uncertainty cramps our style? It's okay. We can take all that anger and pretend it's the other person's fault. Hey, go back to being chill. That other guy, eh. For instance, some people that are perfectionistic expect other people to be perfect too. Sure, it's one thing if I try to do everything perfectly, but I can't. And it starts spilling out. I start judging other people for not being perfect. If you're around this kind of person very much, you know, you start feeling judged. And then they start telling you why you're wrong. It becomes this control issue. But we all do this sometimes. There's always stuff we don't like about ourselves. For instance, the roots of road rage are in ourselves. What if you make yourself late, then start blaming the other drivers on the way because they're making you slow? Sometimes we do this thing where we forget the humanness of the other person, kind of for fun. With sports teams, for instance, we start dissing the other guy's team. Maybe it's just part of the competition. But as soon as it loses its playfulness, we lose sight of the other person's humanness. And that's how all this projection stuff works. It's okay to play the blame game in your head. Maybe you can feel a little better for a few minutes when you blame the other person. But it turns into something completely different when you start acting out that blame, when you forget the other person's humanness. We're out of time for today though. If you like these videos, please subscribe and share. I'm here for a delicious mind, Thursday 7 Central, here on YouTube. And help me keep these videos advertisement free. Click on the link below and contribute to my crowdfunding campaign. Every little bit helps. See you next time as we continue to explore our mind.